All right, Billy Billy. Uh, we have so much to celebrate right now, China, uh, to raise a glass and a toast to. Uh, number one uh, would be over a million people uh, joining this movement of me and you guys now on this platform of Billy Billy. Uh, I was really so blown away by the by the just the insane growth that happened so quickly in less than 48 hours, over a million people. So we will continue the movement. We will continue the growth. Um, and, um, and I want to say thank you guys so much for joining me. Uh, what a pleasure it is um, to, because it's also such an indicator of the connection that we have that, um, that actually I'm really quite proud of. So I want to thank you guys for that. And also, um, I want to cheers to um, Hobbs and Shaw. Uh, Hobbs and Shaw coming out, my new movie coming out. I know you guys are excited to see it. I, I cannot wait for you guys to see this movie. Um, it comes out in a couple of days. It comes out this Friday. And um, can't wait for you to see it. And the other thing I wanted to toast to is, uh, is my last trip to Beijing and to China. So that's what you guys are getting ready to see, by the way. So after I'm done talking here, uh, I'm going to show you an inside look at my last trip, which I think was about three weeks ago uh, when we were in China. Um, went to Beijing, had a spectacular trip in Beijing. The crowd, the energy, your energy, your love um, was just incredible. But this time when I was in China, it was a little different. It was just special. And I felt it and I felt like China felt it too because it was a, for the very first time I was actually going to go to another city. I went to Guangzhou, which was again spectacular. And that electric energy was just, uh, was just it was, uh, it was so real and it was so amazing and it was actually quite humbling too as well. So I want to thank you guys so, so much for that. I'm raising a glass. Actually, I have a glass of tequila right here, uh, unlike last toast. But I do want to say this. If um, by the time I post this, you guys in China are a day ahead. Right now, I'm in Hawaii, the islands of Hawaii. By the time I post this, you're a day ahead. You probably would have heard the news. The news is true. It is, in fact, uh, um, true that I did get married today. I got married, <laughs> very, very excited. Um, there's the ring uh, on my finger and beautiful girl. I've known her now for three months and we, I'm only kidding. <laughs> I've known her for two weeks. Look, the marriage is gonna last. I just met her last night. I'm only kidding. I've known her for 12 years. Lauren Hashin is her name now known as Lauren Johnson. She is the love of my life and the mother of my babies. Um, but I could not be more excited to share that news with you, China. Um, so cheers to family, cheers to love, cheers to always protecting family, cheers to Hobbs and Shaw this Friday, and um, enjoy the movie, and um, you know what, and cheers to China, cheers to you guys for, um, for always being so gracious to me and so kind um, and so embracing. Uh, we have an awesome relationship and I don't take it for granted and uh, I enjoy delivering movies and many more things that I'm working on um, To deliver to you guys the people there in China. So cheers China and uh, Billy Billy going by Enjoy Hobbs and Shaw and enjoy the special look at my last trip to Beijing. Cheers That is good tequila. All right, I'm coming honey. I'll be right there <laughs> One of the greatest parts of my job is traveling to the farthest reaches of the world to personally connect with the culture and the incredible fans. <laughs> the amazing people of China have always welcomed me with open arms and so much love and electric energy. And every time I return, I'm humbled and moved all over again. Yeah. So handsome. The muscle man, you know, I love it. I love it, bro! I love you! It is really astounding. Growth within the Chinese market has long been a goal very dear to me through our films and beyond. 
and I feel so fortunate for the opportunities to expand and deepen our partnerships within China and continue to engage and serve the Chinese people in many different ways. No matter how many hours I've flown, no matter how many miles we've traveled, regardless of what country it is, the first thing I need to do to get ready for the workday is I gotta find the gym. I need to find my local iron paradise. You work out a lot. How long do you spend at a gym every day? Um, and what sort of steps do you work out? Well, I usually spend about, uh, maybe about an hour and a half to two hours mm -hmm. every day. It is true that you eat seven meals a day for your muscles. <laughs> Uh, ten. <laughs> ten pounds a day? Uh, I don't know what it adds up to. Maybe for the story, it's so like twenty pounds. <laughs> twenty pounds a day. <laughs> The Rock eats 20 pounds of food <laughs> every day. It's a good story. Like, what would it take to beat Jason Statham yeah, yeah, in a fight? Jason, yeah, yeah. You just gotta pop him right in the face. But uh, but when you fight Jason, it's not like fighting him like that. It's not like you could throw a jab and you just hit him like that, because he's that he's that tall. Mm -hmm. So you have to you hit him like that, <laughs> down. That's how you hit him in the face. He um, is just as 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 handsome and as sexy and well, just everything. He smells good. He really smells good. Just like the real thing. <laughs> so here we are, Madame Tussauds, and this is a, a historical night because this is an honor for me. My second Madame Tussauds figure, and I could tell you uh, from experience that, uh, that this guy, very, very strapping. Look at the chest on him, tattoo and all, and what an honor. Cheers, tequila toast to Madame Tussauds. I wanna say thank you guys so, so much. So cheers. It's good tequila, what do you think? You happy? You're a sexy son of a bitch. He talks. <laughs>come back here to China. It's always an, just an, an incredible experience and, and I know uh, you guys are, are just as happy to see me and only me as I am just as happy to see you. This is the time where you have to push that much harder. In this moment, this defining moment, we take our number one movie in the world around the world. And it's with immense gratitude and humility that I finally bring our Hobbs and Shaw movie to China. Uh, it's a fun part about this spin-off. It allowed us to delve deeper into our backstories and into our families, to delve into this idea of everything that his mom means to him and everything that, you know, his mom means to me too. <laughs> I mean, I'm sorry. No, I, meant, I didn't mean that. Uh, just, I meant his sister. I mean, dim the lights. As China continues to grow and the fan base continues to grow and I'm fortunate enough to continue to come over here and visit and connect with the people of China, I'd like to think that one day there's gonna be a young rock who's going to see my movies somewhere here in China who will one day grow up to, to be the next me of China or be the next me of the world. Yeah,